Okay, this is going to be a demonstration of how to do a, a video chat with multiple people using the new Skype 5.0 beta software. This is Mike Fisher, instructional coach and educational consultant with digigogy.com, D-I-G-I-G-O-G-Y.com. And I am going to initiate the call by first calling the group. I already have a uh, group set up here. If you did not, you would add one person and then you would click on the add people button to add multiple people to this video chat. So I'm going to start by calling the group. All right. Okay, who's on? I'm on. I'm on. Okay. First video, can you see me? Um, not yet. I can see you, Liz. And I can't see Monica yet. I'm going to click on my video down here at the yeah. bottom. I'm recording our conversation so that I can save it to um, Screen Toaster. Okay. So I'm clicking on my video at the bottom, and there I am at the bottom now. Okay. I and see you. Monica's screen should pop up here whenever she enables the video. Monica, at I the did. bottom, did you click I on did. my video? Okay. I can see you too, and I can see myself. Oh, there we go. I can see you, Monica. Okay. I don't have Monica yet. There we go. Yep. All right. Now we have everybody involved. This is a um, multiple video chat with Skype's new 5.0 beta software. So now we can all talk at the same time, even though we're in three different places. Yep. And yep. say something educational. <laughs> All right, Monica, your turn. Good teachers assess formatively often. Good. I agree with both of those statements. <laughs> All right, for the sake of the screen toaster video, um, I just want to look at the controls along the bottom. There's a mute right. button. Uh, there's a button to control volume. There's a button to add more people to the video chat, but I think in the free version you can only have up to three people at a time uh, talking. I'm hoping that'll change. If you okay. don't see your video, you'll have to click on the My Video button here on the bottom. And then if you want to end the call, it's the red receiver button over here, which is what I'm going to do right now. Okay, what's, the share, what's the share button for? Uh, the share button um, is something that I'm sure will be enabled after the free trial is over, like if, we wanted, if I wanted to share my screen with the two of you. So what I'm going to do is I've re I'm recording what we're doing here, and I'm going to save this to my website at digigogy.com, D-I-G-I-G-O-G-Y.com. Or if you have questions about how this works, you can email me at MikeFisher821 at gmail.com. So thank you for participating, wife and friend. <laughs> thank I'm you, Mike, for teaching. I'm going to end the call now, and then I'll put this video on my website so that you can also share it with other people so that we have some how-to videos about using uh, multi-video chat through Skype. Okay. Thank you. All right. Have a good afternoon. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. You too. Bye. All right. I have ended the call, and it's going to take me back to the main Skype screen, it'll show me, it'll tell me that my call with uh, Monica and Liz is over. I click close and it's going to go back to my regular screen, uh, which where it will show me who in my network is online um, and where I can go to start chatting or video calling someone else. So I hope that is helpful. Have a good afternoon.